Welcome back, my lords, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play XCOM Enemy Unknown. Now, as we restart our Iron Man game, we have had submitted to us about 40 different to the situation room. squaddy Commander names. To the situation room. Commander, good news. Oh. The Council has donated a satellite. Our oh, current nice satellite uplink facility can support up to two satellites, so I recommend we launch the new one immediately. Do you now? Well, who the hell asked you? Okay, um... Botched trip? Bollocks, was it botched? Okay, let, let's launch our damn satellite. Satellite. Oh, and um, we don't seem to get to choose. I'm guessing this is still sort of tutorial. Oh, no, 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 we can. We have to select here. Um, so the US will give us the most amount of money. Although China, as we know, is currently in quite a poor position. Um, and Russia. Hmm, Russia does offer a fair amount of money. Why is Nigeria? I'm not, not that I'm criticising, you know, I'm grateful for any support. I'm going to give it to Russia because at least that's near China. Okay. Do it. With this additional satellite in place, do it, do we now. gained a significant upgrade uh, to our overall coverage. What you I recommend for? we begin scanning for alien contacts right away. Billy, 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 Billy. Ooh, ah, Jesus Christ. And we can't go back. We've got to scan for activity. All right. I wanted to get... Satellite coverage now available over Russia. Well, lucky us. Okay, what I'm trying to do is getting back to my barracks so I can rename some of my squad. risk squatties. the lives of our troops so we can take one of these things alive. Alive. Yes. Without a live specimen, I'm afraid we've reached the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. You're insane! And how do you suggest we do this, Doctor? The Being autopsy I just completed confirms that the alien's physiology is quite similar to our own. A highly concentrated electrical current delivered at close range should cause neuromuscular... Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth the risk? I do. Well, who asked you again? You're an engineer! How can we hope to stop something that we do not understand? If we can capture one of these creatures alive, we may be able to communicate with it. And interrogate it. Find out what they want. Ah, appeal to the Whether American soldier. For, yes. That no offense to any American soldiers. Risks, in my opinion. I can construct a safe enough facility to house our captive, but I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. All right. I'll speak to the commander. I'm I'm right here. Okay, I want to go to the barracks. So Where is it? It's this one. Oh. We can't launch another satellite, can we? We don't have enough money. Um, well, that's interesting. I'm guessing these are all places we can... This is like bloody Dungeon Keeper, isn't it? Okay. Alright, let's go to this. No, we can't go to the Situation Room. That's not what we want. We want to go to Mission Control. So we need to capture a live alien. We've managed to successfully map the alien specimen's entire genome, although I wasn't entirely sure it would be possible using our existing DNA sequencing techniques. Fortunately it was. However, our sex, 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 our sex with the alien has led to the startling realisation that this creature's genetic structure is quite similar to our own. What could that mean? Okay, so yes, we need some live aliens. I remember they asked us to get that in the last mission, but they didn't equip us with a method of doing so. Commander, based on Dr. Valen's I'm report, that was me I recommend upstairs. we begin researching the new weapon she's calling the Arc Thrower in the labs. Once completed, we can send the plans down to engineering for fabrication, and then equip one of our troops with it in the barracks. Dr. Shen and the engineering team are also waiting on approval for construction of the containment facility that we'll need in order to house the alien captive. I don't like it. 
Commander to Engineering. Okay. Commander, currently being led by the are nose. Aware of Dr. Valen's request to capture one of the aliens. A sound plan, but she fails to realize that we lack a facility to safely contain a live specimen. I know, With I your was approval, there. My team and I will begin construction of a suitable facility. Okay, build facilities. I'm guessing we probably won't have enough... We're still in the tutorial. I thought as much. Well, that's not bad, I suppose. Yeah, see, we don't have the money for it. Okay. Thank you, Commander. I'll let you know when the facility is ready. Dr. Valen has asked to see you, Commander. Oh. No doubt she wishes to explain her plan personally. Commander to the research labs. Commander. All right, I'm coming. Commander, I'm sure you've been briefed on my request. Yes. With your authorization, we can begin research on the arc thrower immediately. Arc thrower, then. Commander to mission control. Commander to mission control. Why does that Commander, not surprise me? We're picking up widespread radio chatter indicating UFO sightings within our current satellite coverage area. We should begin scanning for contacts as soon as possible. Alright, let's launch some probes. It looks like that satellite we launched paid off. We're picking up an unidentified fast mover. If we scramble an interceptor now, it's we a may be able to take it down. Oh, uh, let's go for that one. Go, go, Barracuda! I could end badly if we shot into the wall. We have eyes on the bandit. I've got to be honest, the Terror from the Deep uh, music was slightly more... Hey, there we go. Was slightly more tense. Woo, yeah, 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 we won the war! We have a confirmed kill on bogey 001. I repeat, the UFO is out. Houston! I'll copy, over. We have won. I'll copy, PD-37. Nice work. Oh, you Central stop lab. fucking clapping! Right, people. Retask Recon Satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. Oh my god, we just Unstreet. destroyed Hamburg. Magnify. Yes, we did. <laughs> it's made of stars. What? Still in one piece. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. Well, that doesn't surprise me. Okay. Well, we can't ignore it. Okay, well, we've got a few people to look at that. Look at the genuine gamer there. Rookie Thompson. Oh, I know an Amy Thompson. Rookie Thompson, I don't know whether... YouTuber. Yes, Vice. I don't think you're female. But you sure as shit are now. Welcome aboard, girl. Marvel owner, yes, he's uh, he's who we were expecting. Oh dear God! All right, so this is our mission. I'm gonna put a line for revise his name now because uh, yeah, there we go. Touching down. Touching cloth once again. Sorry, I'm being puerile. Our target site is near the German border. This stuff will make you a like goddamn sexual tyrannosaurus. Area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. <laughs> yeah, because if they don't, they're fucked. Uh, we splashed a UFO with what? Sweep the area surviving crew and neutralize them and avoid additional death. Okay. Let's rock! Hey, Marvelona, you look this how I can. We're just north of the crash site. 
Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear. We're north Sky. of the crash site. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Hmm. But there's no compass to tell Looks us which like way. Looks the crash site is dead ahead. We should expect heavy resistance here. So there's we. There's no telling how many hostiles were on board. Approach the craft with caution and attempt a breach if possible. So we can expect that it's actually the way we're facing. Gentlemen gamer. Oh, I'm referring to myself in the third person. You can approach via this way. I wouldn't recommend climbing over scenery like that. It does kind of expose you for the idiot to... Oh. Marvel owner, you will back up Jake Armitage. He's a proven soldier. Vice, you're coming with me. I like how the alien activity is. Isn't that dissimilar to predator predator text? I don't mean that in a sexual predator kind of a way. Hmm. I think we're gonna have to dash into cover here. That is full cover as well. Go for it, Jake. Gentlemen, don't go doing something stupid now. I think we'll set you on Overwatch. Okay, Marvel owner. We need you up with Jake. I think we'll set you on Overwatch as well. We just leave Viced. Could send Viced up the uh, center. Is that really us? No, yeah. Oh. We'll put him there, although it is exposing Vice a bit. Okay, Jake Armitage. What's looking good? Now, some more full cover there from Jake. Here they come. Alright, let's not get distracted by them. Jake Armitage and Marvel owner can deal with those two. Need to stick to the full cover. Gent, you go uh, this. Up here, I think. Hostile spotted. The alien craft is still intact. Oh dear. Got some kind of energy field protecting parts of the ship. We'll have to look for an opening. Hmm, I don't think we're gonna get a shot on them. No. All right, Marvel owner. Shame we can't dash up there because I think that would suitably frighten the alien. But that does get you into some cover there. Go for it, Marlona. If we ha take send YouTube advice up here, it might frighten the aliens, although I doubt it. Yeah, I'm not that confident. Oh god. Don't worry, they get a second shot. You blew my cover! Sorry, that's always so tempting. Alright, well so much for them being cowards and running away. Oh, no. No, damn it. 
Oh, shit. Why does that happen every single time I play? Re Gentleman Gamer always dies on his first damn mission. YouTube advice, it's up to you to avenge me. Oh, for fuck's sake. Get a grip, Jake Armitage. Alright, Marvel owner, I'm gonna send you in for close quarters. There's no way you can miss. Really, there isn't. Okay, Viced. You get full cover if you hide behind that tree. And do we want you dashing in? I think you're, you're going to be better off there. And then take a shot. Yes! Good shooting, Viced. You can take that, Marvel owner. You're all fine. You're okay. All right, now take the shot, Jake. I know you are not exactly. Um, hmm. Could take. Could send a frag grenade in. No, no. We'll fire. Good shooting. Sure, I just heard a chainsaw rev up. Stay alert. Okay, I know there's another alien up here. And there he is. Oh, he's going to regret missing. Although somehow there's still a good chance of missing. Vice, you'd better hit. Toasted. Yeah, someone is attacking Vice from the south. Vice, you are on your own for the time being. We're taking this route up here, Jake Armitage and Marvel owner. Then we're going to have to dash into some proper cover. To withstand an impact like that, at such a velocity. The materials oh. used in that vessel's hull must be at least an order of magnitude beyond any element we know of. Our readings can't be right. If they were, that's a being of almost pure energy. The readings coming from that creature are like nothing I've ever seen. You can study it when it's dead, Doctor. Let's take that thing down. Downtown. All right, make it count. Yeah, that was expected. The vice has got a got a potential shot as well. We know something is shooting at her from that oh that angle. No, I don't like. It. Oh bugger! Adjusting aim. Okay, well, we know who um, the person with the low bloody morale in this game is, don't we? Right. Excellent, we hit. Alright. This time we're going to move up a bit first. Maybe get a better shot. No. 
I'm guessing that if he's made of pure energy, he might explode when shot. So I don't want anyone getting too close. I think uh, next round requires grenades. Ah, he's hunkering down, is he? No. Well, Jake Armitage, you were always were a bit of a pussy. Alright, frag grenade. Actually, no, we don't want to destroy the damn thing. Yeah. You will be avenged, Squaddy Armitage. Yeah, I know it's dangerous. Dead is disconstruct. Mission accomplished. Incredible. Ooh. It seems to have vanished. Well, uh, again, at what cost? At what cost? Once again, we lose our experienced member of the crew. Okay, Marble Owner, you are a support. And it has his vice. Let's see whether we can keep them alive. Ooh. Operation Vengeful Summer, a relative success. Welcome back, Commander. I wanted to speak to you about our current fleet of interceptors. It's crucial that we keep several of these aircraft on high alert. We'll need them to intercept any future alien contacts. And it's likely we'll suffer some losses in the process. I think it's also worth mentioning that even a full squadron of interceptors will do no good against our enemy if we don't know where they are. Additional satellite coverage will be required before we are able to detect alien craft elsewhere on the planet. Visit us in engineering should you wish to build additional satellites. Goodbye, Commander. You know, I, I would, but I don't have any money. Commander, we've suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. Uh, so many already dead. Why the? We're not Scottish. Oh, look at them. Never even promoted above rookie. What a waste. Okay then, let's get some of these renamed. Hello Alessandro. Your first name will now be... Screaming... Doom. Kira Connolly? Sorry about this, Jeff is now Jeff Garrison. Formerly Fiend77, you may remember his performance from the previous XCOM game. Li Ming Zhao. Anon. Gemini. This is like a school reunion, isn't it? Well, Svetlana, you are now well, YouTuber. Tetsubo. I'm putting um, YouTuber as a prefix when usernames are literally just one word. Nico still injured. Marvel owner. Okay, yeah, we're done. Can't really I still do can't much. believe Dr. Vaughan expects our troops to try to bring one of those things back here in one piece. Much less alive. Several members of the Council have expressed an interest in acquiring some of the artifacts we've recovered. However, we should be careful in choosing what items we release. 
The research team may not have discovered their true value yet. Um, I'm Commander, not... the artifact we're about to sell to the Council hasn't been examined by the research team. I'm sure Dr. Valen would be... disappointed if we put financial gains ahead of our own research and development. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, we've still got ten sectoid corpses. I personally think that we can afford to get rid of nine of them. Okay. Now we will hire some more soldiers. Two more soldiers! Let's scan. Ooh, okay. What do we research now? So we've got our non-lethal pulse thrower. Let's go for... Hmm, beam weapons. Let's do an autopsy on the sectoid. We've made a number of interesting discoveries based on the autopsy results of the alien specimen you brought back. The research team is now referring to this particular variation as a sectoid, based on the unusual structure of its internal organs, which we believe to be the product of genetic manipulation. As we've seen in the field, this species also seems to harbor some sort of telepathic ability. He's one messy coroner, isn't he? Now we need to build an arc thrower, but we can't afford it. Damn. Alright, so we're going to have to sell some more gear. Has to be done. If we're going to get an arc thrower out of this. Well, we'll build one. Alright, we need to start... So, well, we can't equip anyone with anything terribly special just yet. No. Measuring control. Scan for activity again. Even unlocking achievements, I don't know what they're for. Containment facility online. Ah, excellent. I would assign I'm I'm tempted to assign more. We've still got some room to grow up here. But if we really want to expand our facilities, we're going to have to start excavating beneath the base. Unfortunately, the deeper we go, the more it's going to cost. Uh Yeah. Except we can't afford it. No, we can't afford to build anything right now. We need to go and kill something, don't we? Commander, we're receiving a transmission from the Council. Coming on screen. Is it Al Jolson again? Mummy, the blackface uh, council member. Friend of this council has come under attack by aliens in the UK. It would reflect poorly on our efforts if we were to allow our allies to be captured by hostile forces. We'll need you to ensure his safe return to XCOM HQ. We should have further details by the time your troops reach the extraction site. The 140 euro pounds, dollars, yen, yen. Of course. We are confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. Okay. What can we put in place? Ooh, the arc thrower. Nico is going to have the arc thrower, I think. And Weist. No, no, the wrong one. It does get very Game of Thrones esque, doesn't it? I don't think we need the pistol as well as... Oh, apparently we can't get rid of it. Yeah. 
Um, I feel it's probably worth someone having a medikit. Although Vice was pretty accurate in the last one. Rookie Garrison, you're a medic. Screaming Doom. You can use our scope. Although I can't for the life of me remember whether it does actually increase our accuracy. Alright, people. Okay, sweethearts. To the UK! Visual on the mission site. Setting down. Begin the assault. The next deployment site is in the UK. Find the target, escort the target safely to the extraction point. Okay, we know how to do this this time. In Birmingham? Alright. Lovely. We could stop in at the UK Game Center. Oh, and it looks exactly like Birmingham, too. Thomas Hutch, a friend of the Council, was riding in the limo at the bottom of those steps when it was hit by an alien ambush. Okay. We need you to find Mr. Hutch, make sure he's safe, and get him safely back to the Sky Ranger. New objective received. Why do you say new objective received after? Well, YouTube advised, I'm going to suggest dashing in your first turn all the way up to there. Flush the enemy out. Nico has got the stun weapon. So we need Hostile her up front. Spotted. Those chaps are strange, aren't they? Okay, Screaming Doom, don't get distracted. I think I'm going to want to put you on Overwatch. Yep. And we need to make this other one panic, don't we? I hope it doesn't take a shot at Nico. They're moving to fight me. Oh god. There's heavy fire in the zone. Well, that's all right. That's okay. Hey, we could really use a hand with these things. Ah, he's still down by the limo. Then. Let's try using one of these smoke grenades. If we throw it here, they won't be able to shoot at us. Oh, that didn't work. Ah. All right, can we stun? Ah, uh, we need to get closer to him. All right. How close can she get? Do it. Subduing time. Yes. Well done, Nico. Down you go, Screaming Doom. Back up Viced. We have the smoke to protect us. Hello? Who's out there? Uh, I'm back here by the van. We have a new objective. 
Oh, they're not stupid, are they? Raining death over here. Oh, don't over exaggerate. Excuse me, I'm back here by the delivery van. I can't say I like his attitude much. Okay, Vice. What sort of bead have you got on them? Mm -hmm. Take a shot. Missed the target. Okay, Collard. Now, who are they? Are they humans? I'm guessing they're not alien. Target acquired. Oh, that's a lot of aliens. stabilize anyone. Alright, Jeff. So phases is done. Shoot the kill, shoot the kill. Has the smoke disappeared already? Oh, it's looking bad for Screaming Doom. Take it fire. Well, that's alright, clearing a bit of the cover. Well, between... Well, <laughs> it means I'm more likely to get shot at as well. Anyone? Hello? I'm here! I am aware of this, Mr. Hutch. But the last time I attempted a mission like this, simply by, uh... Hmm. There's a 50% chance. I like those odds. Can't kill him if you don't hit him. Well, no shit. Oh, it would be good, wouldn't it, to get that one with the stun. Hmm. But getting up there without actually getting shot. We can do this, Nico. Okay. X-ray eliminated. Good shooting, Screaming Doom. Alright, Garrison. I don't know that there's any point to actually shooting that one. Really, I need that one killed. So I know they're going to take shots at us now. There's not much I can do about it. They're moving around the side. This could be and badly. Oh, thank the Lord. Hello? Who's out there? I'm back here by the van. 
Yes, I appreciate your constant reminders, Mr. Hutch, but it is not helping the situation. Now, really, I need to select... Now, so I need to get him stunned first. Hope this works. No, it didn't. Target is not disabled. In that case... That's the thing, I wasn't that keen on killing the aliens just at this stage. Um, if I had the possibility of taking one alive. Go for the kill shot. Or just, you know, shoot thin air. I don't think Nico's going to be as lucky this time. No, she didn't die though. Unlike Screaming Doom, who very much did die. Excuse me! I'm back here, by the delivery van. Well, if the aliens don't kill him, I sure as hell will. Alright, I'm gonna... I'll contemplate my next move depending on what happens to Nico here. Damn, she can't stun anymore. All right. X-ray neutralized. Kill confirmed. Yeah, it wasn't ideal. But we should have a thin man. Hello? I'm here! Right, I'm gonna start getting these guys to back out. I don't need all of them approaching the civilian. Out there. Uh, I'm back here by the van. The map seems slightly smaller than they did in Tower from the Deep. God, get me the hell out of here. Oh. We should get the VIP back to the Sky Ranger on the double. For now, we will protect him. How, how can we get up here? Is that, that's the only way? Good God. All right. going to put in a good word for you if we make it out of here. I appreciate your candor. Heads up, boys and girls. Intel suggests hostiles are headed right for you. Shame we don't have a sniper. There we go. I'm 
I should think so. Huh. Maybe my security detail should be getting its equipment from your suppliers. Maybe you should be supplying me with more money. I know we're kind of exposing him there. Stay on Overwatch there, Vice. If we can get through this with only one casualty, I will rate this mission a success. I'm grateful my friends on the Council were able to put together this rescue operation. I owe you all my sincerest thanks. Yep, you just get yourself up to that launch pad. Just received some intel that hostiles are advancing on your location. Ready up. Excellent. Negative. Weapons dry. Oh. It's killing time. Doesn't quite have the same ring to it as it's clobbering time. Now, which one of these two do I try to take out? Hmm. Um, if I actually moved there, it wouldn't be able to hit me. The other form from the other side, I mean. Well, slightly less likely. That's the plan, anyway. If I make it out of here alive, I'm gonna make sure you receive all the support I can provide to your project. Well, I appreciate it, sir. You risked your lives for me. Oh, God. I owe you a debt of gratitude. Damn it. Objectives updated. The VIP is secure. Excellent work, Strike oh. One. Wipe out any remaining aliens. Out of ammo here. Executed to the number, Strike One. Ah, we got him in Overwatch. And although I'm fairly certain the civilian died there, apparently he didn't. 